how to manage the health and fitness data on your phone and control which apps can access it on the Samsung Galaxy S24 series. First, tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Now from the home screen, swipe down at the top, then tap on the settings icon. Next, in settings, we scroll down, then tap on security and privacy. After that, we scroll down and tap on more privacy settings. In here, tap on Health Connect. Now at the top here, it will show you recent uh, apps has access to Health Connect. And if you go down to Permissions and Data section, you can tap on App Permissions. In here, there currently there is only one app, the, health, the Samsung Health app, uh, accessing my data, my health data. So in here, I can tap on the app. And from here, I can choose to allow all so I can choose to allow all or remove all. So it's here, also delete Samsung health data from Health Connect. So I can remove all the permission without removing the data. And you can tap on the toggle button to turn them all on. You can scroll down the list and you can individually turn each of the items on or off. So at the top here is the button that turn all of them on at once or switch them all off at once. But you can go down here and uh, turn them on or off individually one by one So if you go down all the way down to the bottom you can also tap on delete app data And here say choose data to delete this permanently deletes Samsung health data Add it to health connect in the chosen time period So you can do that as well Now if we go back to app permissions you can see here, not allow access any apps has request permission, but uh, that you haven't granted the permission will be uh, located in the not allow access. You can always go in here and grant the app permission to access your health data. At the bottom here is the remove access for all apps. So you can tap on that to remove all access to all apps. Now, if we tap on the back here, this will take you back to health connect. Down here, you can tap on data and access. And from here, you can view uh, all the things that has been recently accessed or your health data that has been recently accessed. So uh, I have just recently used the Samsung uh, health app to record a walking exercise. So I can tap on activity. I can uh, manage the data such as uh, distance. And you said here, can we distance Samsung health? Can write distance Samsung health? And I can view all the entries and I can delete the data as well. So you can see here all the data is recorded. I have walked 0 0.017 kilometers and all that data has been recorded into your Samsung Health Connect. So what you can do is if you don't want that data to be recorded, you can tap on delete this data. And here we've got distance, we've got exercise, uh, we've got steps and you can view all the entries. So here it recorded, I have uh, walked 26 uh, steps. So a lot of data has been recorded and uh, you can control, finally control how this data is stored on your device. If you want to delete them, you can do so as well. So that is your data uh, stored and how or which apps can access them. Now at the bottom here, the last set, uh, option is manage data. If you tap on that, you can choose auto delete and this will automatically delete your data after three months, after 18 months, or never. By default, it is set to never. So here's a control how long your data is stored in Health Connect by scheduling it to delete after a set time. And that's it. And other options are data source and priority. So here it shows uh, data source, activity, uh, sleep. So depending on what you have used, the more you use the health app, the more information will be available in here. And you can set the units. So height, you can change the height to centimeters or feet in inches, weight to pounds, kilograms of stone, distance to kilometers or mile, energies to calories or kilojoules, and temperature to Celsius, Fahrenheit or Kevin. And that's it. Finally, you can tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. 
Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos.